Richard Bayer is the CEO of Manam Resettlement Authority. He met with representatives of Ingerose Corporation, the contractor to Japanese International Corporation Agency, Ochaika, and expressed that equipment has always been an issue for them. This has resulted in delayed roadworks to Andarum, the resettlement location for the displaced Manam Islanders. Other issues like accessing gravel to build the roads have hindered progress. Under its capacity development on road maintenance initiative, JICA has proposed to support the Manam project with expertise training, technological support and infrastructural development. Koishikawa Kazuharu, a senior engineer with Ingerosek, is coordinating this initiative. He met with Mr. Baya and Dr. Figa Boga, chairman of the authority and technical officers to discuss where support will be applied. The most important thing is sustain. How we can maintain properly our machine and also how we can tra train uh, self-development can um, sustain ongoing on. Mr. Kazuharu said he visited Underroom and had a fair idea of the challenge in advancing the roadworks. He also confirmed that JICA machinery, including a front loader, excavator, drum roller, motor grader and a dump truck have been taken up to the construction site to commence work. The Manam Resettlement Authority will utilize staff of the Department of Works and Highways to operate the machines. According to the as a further request, the uh, JICA is a great new project as a phase. Mr. Baya said DOWH has also constructed a new bridge along Mugil on the North Coast Road and have indicated that the authority will maintain the old bridge. So that's a very good news for the resettlement project. They will help us with the road work. At the same time, this uh, relationship and meeting will bring us another good news. They might give us a huge bridge to put on one of the main river crossing. Hopefully, we should get some other people in as soon as we can to the resettlement area and give them their land loss. We hope and believe that uh, with uh, the increased funding, the government is going to help us. We should be able to achieve the milestone of 2030 when we wind down our activities and get majority of the Manam people into the resettlement blocks. The Manam Resettlement Authority is hopeful that it can expand on the relationship with JICA to assist with other developments in the Manam Resettlement Project. Dr. Boga said the authority made a 20 million kina submission to the government this year and have received 4 million kina already in the second quarter. He said project implementation has stalled because of funding challenges. Salome Vincent, TV1 News.